Okay, Bruce. Yeah, no, no, no. You just fuck off, dude. You just... Uh, seriously, I'm gonna have to kill you soon. Pancake, please, like, sting him or something. I mean, I... I you took Steve Irwin. The least you can do is kill a Bruce, too. Good morning, Vietnam! Welcome back. Oh, we need to find some water, evidently. Welcome back to another episode of Stranded Deep, ladies and gentlemen. Now, water is not going to be that big of an issue today because in the last episode, as you can see, we got a bunch of drinkable coconuts. Now, I waited because I didn't want to bulk record this series. I want to get your guys' suggestions on uh, how to do this, and I'm really glad uh, you guys know more than me. So, in this solar still, you're, you're, you can actually use a drinkable coconut that you've already drinking to fill it up and drink again. So that is obviously huge for us. Uh, we might actually need to get another still here, which is going to be totally fine because we do have another tarp over there. But now we don't even need coconuts because we can rely on this. Now, obviously, it will probably be smart to still have some coconuts around, but that is huge. That means that we are going to be okay to survive here, and we'll just leave an empty drinkable coconut behind this so we can drink it whenever we want. Now, again, I have no idea. We're going to find out today. It is raining right now, at least. Uh, if these solar stills just fill up when it's raining, or if it just fills up over time, uh, we'll find out. Now, also kind of figure out if I do need more than one of these, uh, just based on how quickly my hydration goes down right now. Anyways, welcome back, everybody, to Stranded Deep. Now, today, now that we got our vitals okay, we got water, we can easily get food. I actually, uh, before I started recording this episode, I got a bunch of crabs, so we can eat those, of course, later on, uh, if we do need to. Mind you, we do got all these coconuts to, uh, eat as well. Also, I killed a boar! Look it! He's dead! It's sad, but, uh, you know what? I needed the leather, so I, I kind of trapped him in a corner and killed him off recording. So yeah, that's pretty much all that you missed. I've just been kind of gathering, uh, you can see, uh, trying to organize the best as I can. Uh, we don't currently have an axe right now. We're gonna be doing some tree chopping today and really getting into building things. Uh, kind of the goal here, or the plan is, first of all, well, first of all, we need to get leather because I want to get a refined pick. I want to see what's in that mineral deposit over there, and we also really need to find clay. Now, I don't know if clay comes out of those. I was told that clay's only in the water, so I think this is maybe just rock or maybe even some sort of precious metal, uh, but we also need to find clay in the water because to make a furnace, we need clay from what I remember, and I did really have a plan here, and I do want to get the clay water bottle still because I'm assuming you can hold a hell of a lot more water in there, and that's just going to allow me to uh, travel with some more water. So, main focus is getting to the refined pig today. Uh, to do that, we need leather. I only got one leather right now. I did kill the pig for the second leather. But to make that leather, we need a tanning tool. Now, in here, we can see the tanning rack requires four lashings and four wood sticks. So, we can actually do that right now. So, let's go start off with that uh, and start doing some tanning here. Now, I kind of got to strategize how I want to lay out this as well, because I don't want it just a clusterfuck of everything. I'm definitely going to have my food station over here, and I think I'm going to have stations. I know a lot of people like to see big-ass structures in this game, but I like the idea of kind of having like a small little village of useful stations. So, we're going to make this handing rack right now that's going to use a lot of my lashings, but that's totally fine. Uh... You know what? No, you know what? I was thinking about making a, a little, like, hut for tanning, but, uh, I think that would just be a huge waste of resources, and I don't have, uh, too many logs to begin with. So we'll just put a tanning rack over here for now. We can always move these and redo them later on. But with that tanning rack now, we're supposed to be able to make leather. So you can see I have a tanning rack. I just need to get the raw hide. Now we get the raw hide off of this little piggy, I think. I hope, anyways. I, I hope I didn't jump to conclusions here. I'm assuming this is where we get raw hides. Now, to get raw hides, I think we also need that tool that uh, we got at the start, which was the refined knife, so we'll make that real quick. There we go. And, yes, hold E to skin. And for whatever reason, I like to stab myself when I skin my pigs. There we go, though. That is a raw hide. Perfect. And he's still got his hide on him. Makes a lot of sense, right? All right, so now if we go over here, we should be able to make some leather. So, go over here, press that, BAM! We got the leather we needed to make the pickaxe. So now we can make, if I can find the leather, it's somewhere over here I know, so we should be able to just make it right now. Um, oh shit, now we need another stone tool though, because I used one stone tool to make that uh, dagger. So, we got enough rocks, we'll make another stone tool, and how much is it just to make an axe, just to make sure? Okay, we need two more stone tools. Uh, we should have, let's just make sure. 
Yes, enough for another stone tool, obviously. And we still got quite a few rocks left. So we got the refined pick. Uh, we should have enough for the refined axe as well. So, or actually the crude axe, sorry. Uh, I guess we could do the refined axe as well, which would take some of my leather. Mind you, we can get more leather now, so maybe we'll make a weapon and go hunt another pig. All right, anyways, let's try the refined pick. We got that bad boy. Uh, hopefully this thing lasts a while, because I just really want to see what's inside these. I have no idea. I don't even know if it's going to help us right now, but damn it, we're trying. Okay, so it is my, my assumption is correct. Uh, that's actually really cool. I like how it actually degrades it. Uh, but yes, this is how to get more rocks. I had a sneaky suspicion that that was the case just because of how little there was uh, in terms of rocks around here. So let's just mine this thing out. Whoa. Uh, is there anything else? That's what I'm curious about. I was hoping there'd be like some iron or something so we can make iron weapons. It doesn't look like... Wait, wait. Okay, that's that's not uh, collectible, unfortunately. So, yeah, it just looks like that's just for rocks. That's totally fine, though, because rocks are a very important commodity in this game and something that was hard to come by for me. So I'm actually kind of excited about that. We actually do have another mineable resource on the other side of the island. All right, and looking at my vitals, uh, you know what? I should heal myself because we are going to go into the water today, and I do want to bring a weapon with me, and I obviously do want uh, some better health. So I'm just going to... You know what? Let's actually... Before we get into the food, let's just make a pickaxe, a crude axe here. That way I can quickly chop these things open. So, quickly eat, and then hopefully heal ourselves a little bit. And then I think we're going to get into the weapons. We're going to try and make some weapons today. I just really want to get a little bit of everything. Because I do want to explore the oceans around this place. Because there's obviously a lot of shipwrecks. I mean, hell, there's one right there. Uh, I saw one over there as well. I think there's one... Uh, over here, I can see every now and then there's a little, uh, I guess you could say wave that pops up. So, uh, yeah, I know there's a lot of shipwrecks around here that I do want to explore. We will definitely be doing that today. All right, let's quickly eat this, though. Delicious coconut. Uh, coconut for days. Uh, I, I love how little the coconuts help, by the way. So we need to be fully fed and watered to actually start healing. So I really do need to, uh, I guess go drink some more of my coconuts. All right, and the delicious coconuts. All right, so let's get, uh, three should be enough for right now, I think. Let's, uh, oh, is it empty? It's not empty, is it? No, it's totally not. It's just not letting me drink it for some reason. Okay, there we go. All right, so that is, I am fully hydrated, so there's no sense of drinking that other coconut. And going back to chopping these things. It's amazing how better these tools are. Getting some good tools early on, very important because uh, it definitely takes a lot less time to uh, break things open, you know, gather things and whatnot, uh, which is obviously very useful. Okay, so we're fully fed and fully hydrated. Now, we should start slowly healing as well. Uh, that snake throughout the night <laughs> attacked me like three times. So, of course, I'm probably going to try and kill that snake today, just so I don't have to deal with him anymore. All right, but while we wait to heal, let's just go around. You know what? Actually, uh, something smart to do would actually be to start chopping this down, because we are probably going to make uh, a little base today. I don't want to just have a shelter and then a bunch of crafting stations. I do plan on having a little base on my own as well. So we'll just do this as we do heal up. All right, it's one in the morning, and I've been uh, kind of being efficient, chopping trees and whatnot. We're just going to sleep for right now, because uh, I think I've done enough throughout the night. And yeah, we'll see what morning brings us. So another beautiful day. This is uh, going to be the day that I think we go into the water here. So I figured we'd just get uh, a few resources here. This is what about eight dead trees looks like. So yes, uh, we should have lots of wood. And we should also be more or less, as you can see, fully healed. So that's obviously very good. So what we're going to do now, we're, we're sticking with the tools today. Uh, we can do like a crude spear. We can do a fishing spear. I'm just looking for some certain weapons that we can utilize to uh, actually fight these guys. I'd actually really like to make the bow and arrow. I think we'll do that very, very soon here. Uh, spear gun arrow, that's not really going to help much. So I think that my best chance right now is to make the refined spear and then the fishing spear. Because I do want to do some fishing as well. Now what happened? There used to be a fishing trap in this game. It's got to be maybe in structures or something. All right, well, riddle me surprised. I think maybe you need to find the fishing boxes now, or nets, traps, whatever you want to call them. Uh, so, yeah, we're just going to make the um, fishing spear, and you know what? We'll just do a crude spear for right now because I don't have any leather, and I need some sort of weapon to get leather. So, uh, yeah, we're not going to get the refined spear just yet, uh, but we will get the fishing spear and then crude spear. Now, I think you're supposed actually, yeah, you can throw these. You guys let me know in the comments below. And that's why I like taking my time with these episodes, because I love getting your input on what I'm doing wrong, what you guys suggest. And you guys were really supportive of this episode. You guys actually were the ones who told me about the coconut as well. So thank you guys for all of your support. 
Uh, I'm just going to drop some stuff off here because obviously we don't want this on us. Also, uh, I was... Oh, wow, we had more than I expected in me. Uh, I was paying attention throughout the night, and this just automatically fills up. So we don't even need to worry about, you know, maybe getting a drought or something. That's always going to fill up, so that's obviously uh, going to make life a little bit easier for us, which is really good. Now, I do really need to do some organizing later on. I think we might even make some storage bays or something, because it's getting a little messy here. We actually haven't done much. Uh, so we just have a lot of resources and survival tools right now, which is probably the smart thing to be doing this early on. All right, so with the crude spear, well, first of all, I, I want to try and knock off a coconut just to see if you guys were correct. Uh, we actually do got a coconut right here, so let's see. Oh, yeah, <laughs> knocked it right off, and it actually sticks in the freaking spear. How cool is that? So now we don't need to break our legs getting coconuts either because we got a perfect crude spear. So I absolutely love that. I love that this can be a range-based weapon and also a melee weapon. Uh, so I'm feeling a little bit safer about going into the water, mind you. It is... Oh, oh, I totally forgot about the seagulls. You know what? Before we do that, I'm going seagull hunting, man. All right, you little shithawk. Yeah, you run away. That's totally fine. Another one of your dipshit friends will land anyways. Uh, I just hope I don't lose my spear by doing this. All right, I'm just going to wait. Wait it out. One of you idiots must land, right? And... Fuck, it broke! And this... <laughs> This fucking idiot didn't even run away. So, yeah, those spears don't last very long. Thankfully, they only cost a stick to make. All right, I got some more this time. This must be their their little landing zone, so I'm just going to wait here for a second. Of course, there's one over here now. These, these guys are just fucking tooling with me. Uh, of course, he flies away as well. All right, land, you little shitbags. Yes, look at that beautiful rock that you can land on. There we go. Okay, just, 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 just... God damn it! All right, I, I, I built a couple. This guy is a serious idiot. All right, come on. Oh, I just wasted one. All right, that's okay. We still we still got one here. No big deal. Oh, hey, little piggy. I uh, killed your friend. My bad about that, by the way. I think I think we're just gonna. Oh, okay. He didn't. He doesn't even know. This this is great. These guys are not that. Oh God, it's stuck in him. That's so wrong. So I only got two crude spears right now. One stuck in a pig, and he. <laughs> Can I just have my spear back? Thank you. All right. Let's try it again here. Oh, 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 God damn it. I broke that one, too. Okay, I'm wasting way too many sticks, but this is actually really fun. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Waiting for it. And totally missed. Great. <laughs> All right. Well, the wild boars are not the brightest in this game. Oh, he did run away, though. They sometimes do get stuck, though, as you can see. So I think it might be smarter to just kind of follow this guy around and keep poking at him until he dies. All right, gonna say if this is uh, how long it takes with a crude spear to uh, kill uh, a little boar. I don't think it's gonna do much to Bruce, guys. This is taking, I don't even know if it's damaging him, that's the problem, but I think it is. Okay, you know what? That didn't That didn't even fucking hit him. Point blank, I can't Can't even aim. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this, this, this might actually work a little bit better. All right, come on, stop wiggling. I just gotta keep hitting you there. This is so wrong. There's, there's so many things wrong with this. All right, at least this spear is holding out, which is great. Okay, there we go. We fucking got him. That only took way too long. All right, but that just means we got some more hides to tan later on, so that's good. And we also got that other boar, which still seems to have hides on him at our base, which is right here. I thought we were further away from the base. But there's your friend. Let's see if more spawn. I think that's all of them on this island. All right, it's nice out though. I'm gonna make one more crude spear. You know what? Let's make two just to be safe. I don't want to break mine fighting Bruce. The damn shit hawks are back. Oh, 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 oh! Wait, wait, wait! Yeah! <laughs> ah, take that, bitch! Okay. <laughs> oh, this is great. Ah, oh, th 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 this is the fun part about Stranded Deep. I love hunting. I love trying to get as much resources as possible so I can have a good time here. Uh, we're doing okay for water and everything. I should probably go uh, use some of my water though, just because. Uh, I want it to refill Well, we are low on hydration. So, there we go. We'll just drink some of this. I mean, this is great. This is so easy to survive now. Our vitals are basically complete. And bam, basically perfect once again. So, I have heard Bruce. Bruce is, like, right around here. Of course, we got this shipwreck that's just tempting me right out here. But every time I come out here, Bruce and his freaking music starts. Oh, oh. See, he's somewhere. I don't see him, though. I never fucking see him. He's way too secretive. Oh, whoa! Whoa, he's in! He's in the land! Look at this, he's right here! I don't think he can attack me, but the land sharks are back! It's quite literally in the land here, so I'm worried if I go out, he should be able to swim right out of this land. So now we gotta 
keep an eye out for that. They can hide in the fucking sand. Damn sand sharks. And is that a flying? Okay, I thought I thought that was a flying pancake, but no, it definitely is a little bit below water here. Oh my god, it's just so close to me. But I know he's gonna come. Fuck it. Doing it. Doing it. Don't think about it. Just do it. Going in. And oh, this is the big one too. So I need to hopefully last long enough to do this. Uh, tab to open. Compass, take that. Another compass? What the fuck is this shit? Alright, Bruce, please don't be out here just waiting for me. Uh, I am. I do need water. Drastically. Oh, come on, hold on to it, buddy! We're fine! Okay, Bruce. Bruce is not nowhere to be seen. Thankfully, we totally looted that. I think there's- Oh, he's right here! Look at- Oh, you didn't get me this time, you little jerk bag! Come on, bring it on, bro! Throw a damn spear at you! Yeah, that's right! Get out of here, Bruce! You jerk! That's so cool. I love that I can throw- Oh, look at- There! there there's another one for you! I'll, I'll remember you now, because you have got two spears in you. Alright, let's just go to the other side of the island and uh, look for some more shipwrecks. I know we got one somewhere out here, I believe. Not too worried about that. What time is it? It's getting late to the day already. God damn, these days go way too quick. Uh, this one we've already looted. I'll quickly check it, though, just in case. I think this is the one with the leather that was on it. Uh, somewhere in here. Oh, I actually took the thing out, didn't I? So that one is definitely looted. Wait, no, it's right here. Uh, oh, wait, there's morphine. I swear we looted this and there was nothing on it. Now we got morphine, so that's actually really good. And I'm also going to just look around. Uh, I should probably bring my pickaxe with me, actually, for some of this damn clay. Clay is the one thing I have no idea how to find, uh, but we should be able to find it today, hopefully. All right, that one's got nothing in it. We still got this thing over here, which has antibiotics and a compass as well. I swear... I swear I looted these! What the hell? Uh, well, I guess we got some more loot, so I may as well not question it. That's totally fine. Uh, is there any other shipwrecks near me? I think those were the major ones that I needed to get. So, yeah, we got three compasses now. Like, we needed that, but we did get some medication, so that's obviously very, very good. And compasses will help us when we are starting to lose, uh, resources. But right now, we're doing fine. Uh, but later on, I think we are going to quickly run out of resources here. What the hell was that? Did I say sardine? Oh, there's sardines in here. Of course, Bruce is still here somewhere, and it is turning nighttime. I do not want to be out in the water at nighttime. That's one thing I will not do. But, uh, I think we can try and do some fishing. Oh, God, no. It's too dark. It's too dark. I can't see far enough in front of me, and I don't like it. So, we're just not going to fish tonight. I was gonna fish, but we got, I mean, we got those boars at home. We got that freaking shit hawk. So we, we can just cook those things up. And I mean, I don't think we're gonna run out of things to do. I got so many resources here. Uh, it is absolutely crazy. So let me go, uh, first of all, figure out where all my tools are. So crude axe, there we go. Refined knife, refined pick. Now let me go and actually skin these boars again. I just wanna see if I can do it multiple times. So we got one. There we go. And yeah, you can actually do it multiple times. Uh, so let's see how much each boar has on it. Is it gonna have more than two? Holy! Oh no, that 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 was definitely meat. So it seems like you gotta do everything. You gotta get the meat off. You gotta get the skin off. And there it goes. It actually vanished. I doubt you guys can see it though, because it is quite dark. Let's actually turn on the fire now that I think about it. And let there be light. There we go. All right. So we got our light now. Uh, it's just so much better with a campfire. Everything's a little bit more simpler. Uh, so we got some meat here. Uh, we did get the raw hide, but we also got the medium meat. Now, we got to remember, we made the mistake before of eating spoiled meat. Uh, we should only eat this, or we should eat this really quickly. So maybe I shouldn't skin the other pig and just let his meat be totally fine. Mind you, the whole pig might spoil too. I have no idea. Uh, we'll just cook these two for right now. And can we skin the bird? That's actually... I didn't think about that. Are we going to get hides off the bird? I think we're just going to probably get a little meat. But, uh, yeah, there's a meat. And the bird vanishes. All right, so we, we, we know that now. The hides come from the pigs, and that's probably it. So there's another hide. And I'm not going to fully get rid of this thing. I'm just going to grab the two hides off him. Oh, it's actually meat now, so I guess I already grabbed the one hide off of him. But we got the another one, so let's quickly tan this as well. There we go. Some leather. And another day. How, we're do how are we doing? We're at seven days survived already. Time flies in this game. Now, I was actually... Uh, I tend to edit as it is nighttime in this game just to kind of uh, make the nights go faster. And I noticed something while I was editing. Something that I missed. So I'm just looking... totally forget where I put my tools. But I need my pickaxe because I think I found clay, guys. Oh, the damn seagulls back too. So want to kill you, buddy, but I'm not going to. Do I have them on me? Okay, I, <laughs> I should probably look at that first. I'm looking around like a dipshit. Anyways, well, first of all, 
Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go here first. So we're going to drop off things that I don't need. Uh, cause there's a few things that are going on right now. I did edit and I noticed some things that I missed. Uh, so you guys are probably already mad at me cause you guys notice things way faster than I do. But we're gonna stick with, uh, having this spear as well as my pickaxe. Now, first of all, there's a locker in this that I missed, so we'll do that real quick. We just need to go in here and get it real quick. It feels like it's way more murky. Anyways, there's a locker right here that hopefully has something in it. Uh, we got an engine. We got some baked beans. Good enough. That's actually, uh, we're really good for food. So, there we go. We'll just get out of here and hopefully Bruce doesn't see me. Oh, that almost kills me every time. It's horrifying. All right. We made it. Totally fine. Bruce didn't eat me. That's the first thing that I noticed. Second thing was a much bigger thing, something that uh, I was worried we weren't going to find. I'm almost certain it is it. Uh, some of you keen-eyed individuals probably noticed it earlier on. I think we got clay. Was it at this one? I was either at this one or the other one. Uh, so yeah, I, I generally edit while I'm playing. I don't know, I'm, I'm weird like that. But yes, my whole... Oh, you're in the water today. Okay, we're just going to ignore you for a little bit. I will kill you one day. Just know that, good sir. But yeah, generally my editing style is to edit while I play games. I know a lot of people don't know that, so... I, I just find it's a good way to notice things that you maybe missed or something like that. Down here, we got a mineable resource, and I'm pretty sure, considering it's kind of orangey... Uh, oh, 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 fuck, 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 I can't get up! I can't get up! There's a Bruce somewhere! Okay, so... Uh, we still gotta deal with Bruce, but I'm pretty sure... Where the fuck is he? There he is, you shitbag. Okay, you're a different one, too. Unless you ate my spear somehow. Here, I'll trade you an engine if I can just mine this. Oh, this jerk. He does not want me to mine his his delicious clay. You know what? Can I can I just whack you? Here, you know what? You're coming so close to the damn land. All right, no, he, he, he has no interest in de dealing with me. So maybe if I just back up for a bit and come back, we might be able to hit that clay. But now at least I think I know what it looks like, so I'm just gonna... Actually, go around here. There's a little pancake there. Hey, hey there, little pancake. Okay, it went into the sand again. Everything loves the sand in this game. Oh, there's actually another one right here. Look at that. Okay. Uh, this is totally not dangerous. This is totally not dangerous. I'm totally fine. I'm right beside the water. I should be okay. All right. Come on. Gotta go get that. Oh, it's really hard to swim in this game, by the way. It is clay! Okay, so that is all I needed to know. We got clay here. This is really dangerous, though. Like, even trying to mine more than, like, one or two. Uh, oh, God. Pancake, don't scare me like that! I, I, I don't mind you around, I just don't like your bigger brother coming here. Okay, so I don't think we're gonna get enough clay. I think we need nine clay to make the furnace, so... Uh, just as a good kind of amount needed, or just to be known how much we need, uh, that is it. So I think I'm just gonna mine the hell out of this. And go back to mining. What the hell? Don't, don't mine myself. Okay, I, I'm, I'm like floating. It's really weird. There we go. Okay, so I got them all. So now I just gotta go loot them. Without Bruce killing me, so I don't think. Okay, there's still another piece of mineable resource here. God damn it! What the hell is my guy doing? Okay, this guy just is not. I mean, it's probably very hard to mine un underground, so I don't blame him. But there we go, and we got another piece of clay. So that only gave me that whole resource only gave me four. So I think there's only going to be four per resource. But that's better than nothing. I'm definitely not complaining. We found the clay. That was something I was worried about. Uh, this totally isn't dangerous at all. There we go, we got another clay here, and let's just start whacking this a bit. Ah, oh, please don't fall off the end, though, that scares me. Okay, come on, just, come on, this takes forever! Alright, get some air, because we don't want to die. Yeah, there you go, buddy. And there we go, we'll just knock down this rock a little bit more. Come on, hurry up. Oh, I, th I think there's actually more in this one. We might actually have enough with these two clay deposits to build what I wanted to build. Now, I don't know what else... Oh, yeah, the we, we also need the, uh... The pot, so that is, uh, used with clay as well. Ah! Ah! Fuck, 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 fuck! Oh, God! I fucking knew it! I got, I got a little too comfortable, and he came. Did he hit me? Okay, he did take one bar, so he doesn't damage me that much. It's still really scary, and now it's really wavy as well, so he can get up even closer to me. Alright, I need, I need this. Oh, fuck! Okay, okay. Gone! I'm out! I'm out! I'm sorry, Bruce! This is your territory, not mine! I'm trying to get up! I can't get up! Alright, get away! Please get away! Oh, okay, thankfully... They don't seem to be that aggressive anymore. Uh, they don't charge you anymore like they used to. Oh, so that's good to know, but still, it is not comfortable being in water around a damn tiger shark. 
Okay, Bruce. Yeah, no, no, no. You just fuck off, dude. You just, uh, seriously, I'm gonna have to kill you soon. Pancake, please, like, sting him or something. I mean, I, I, you took Steve Irwin. The least you can do is kill a Bruce, too. All right, thankfully, the water is so clear right now. I don't even need to go that far, because I think it only spawns in the shallows. So, man, there's a lot of pancakes around here. Uh, so I'm just quickly looking around. You can see, actually, not much more around here, I don't think. So I think we got... Oh, we did actually get 10, so we do have enough for, I think, the clay pot and the furnace, unless the clay takes more than one, uh, the pot, that is. Let's check that real quick. Uh, so yes, that unfortunately does take two, so we still do need one more. Now, is this... Yes, that is the shipwreck that we've already looked at, I believe, so we shouldn't need anything in there. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything else, unfortunately, around. Oh, that's a reef shark here. These are, uh, not dangerous. You can actually kill these for good food. So good to know that he's around as well. Uh, but there's also, obviously, a Bruce around, uh, that really doesn't like me. Oh, this is a different shipwreck, isn't it? Okay, is there any... Doesn't look like there's any loot on this one, unfortunately. No, so we're just gonna pull back, because... Oh, God, I'm hearing Bruce again! Okay, Bruce... <laughs> oh, my God! You are a creepy motherfucker. All right, it didn't get me that time, thankfully, but, uh, now I know, you know, even if I just need to dip my feet in the water, Bruce can be there in seconds. All right, so good news we got. I, I did a lot today. I had a lot of goals that I was hoping to achieve, and I think we hit every single one of them. Uh, we got attacked by Bruce, so that, that that's always a goal of mine. We got uh, our pickaxe done. We got our mining. We got all our clay, too. I mean, that's just huge. So let's just make sure. I believe it is nine clay for... Oh, it's only six clay for the furnace. So... That is something that we can actually make right now. Now, I don't think I'm going to make it just yet because I do want to because uh, clay is so hard to find. I think I'm going to make that at a permanent spot. That way we don't need to make it again. I'm going to make a little building for my furnace basically later on. So I don't really need the furnace just yet because that's just going to unlock. I believe it only is used to make the pots possibly. Is there anything else that needs the furnace? From what I know, it's just for bricks and, pot and uh, water bottles. We don't necessarily need those right now. They would definitely help, uh, but is it is not a prime focus. Regardless, we got the materials that we need to do that, and we will definitely be doing it later on. But with that being said, guys, I think we're going to end this one here now. I want you guys to suggest what we should do next. We can focus on building the raft. We can focus on building a base here. We do have lots of resources, as you can see. So the next few episodes are probably going to be a lot of building uh, and gathering some more resources and obviously exploring the lands. Uh, so yeah, just let me know. What would you rather see? Would you like me to, s to build some um, bases here? Maybe some storage bays and whatnot? Some people suggested that I do a lookout out in the stones up there, uh, which would be obviously a really cool idea. Or should I build a really sick raft? I'd l I love the idea of maybe actually making uh, a movable home raft as well. That's something I always wanted to do in Stranded Deep. I don't know if it's possible just yet, uh, but we can always try it. Regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.